Okay, so this is the ghetto setup, huh? So right now all we have is... Definitely see it. Demonstration of what we've got here, right? We have really hacked together channels with LEDs inside. With LEDs inside. Yeah, I mean, that's our infrared. All right, test two. And you say we can't control the exposure. I haven't looked into it though. The drag. I hope I'm not scratching the. <laughs> yeah, you can't get the whole palm on there. Beautiful. I almost feel like there's something about being able to see your fingers is just as cool. Not too much about you know the interactive. <laughs> yeah. Somehow like digitized like it's already. I wonder if like. I wonder if the projection is like through the window, like you do this, uh -huh. and you're seeing a projection larger somewhere else. Yeah, that's true. No, I, I don't think they have to be in the same place necessarily. Yeah. Give me some some finger, just like what people would normally want to do, right? Like what about a single it's finger? Hard. Yeah, it's hard to move the finger. Yeah, I mean, it's like it's dirty, but... <laughs> That's not nice, nice dots. You should almost like you have a little thing of uh, bucket scented water or something, <laughs> rose water. Right? You put your fingers on. I mean, how fast can it really pick up, right? Like if people are going to try to do yeah. That. Yeah. Now I'm getting the sense that you want to have controls that are more about you know that there's this visitation around the screen that's happening How about this? Uh, maybe frequently, maybe infrequently. Yeah, that's nice, you know, uh, that you're just introducing something into a scene. You definitely want a little bit of like, you know, push into it, you know. So you want a really strong frame. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah. Sure, we got that. <laughs> 